Welcome to the world of design realism with Stratasys J55. J55 is a revolutionary photopolymer 3D printer from Stratasys that will enable businesses to produce full color and full texture prototypes in-house to not only dramatically shorten the product design cycle, but also to yield better final result by not compromising on the quality of your prototype. In this video, we're going to walk you through the unboxing process of a Stratasys J55 3D printer. Before unboxing, make sure to check the shock indicator patches at the delivery of the printer. This will tell you if the shipping crate has gone under a drop or other impact that could potentially damage the printer inside. Also to check is the tape seal on the second pallet to ensure the ancillary items have not been tampered with. First, we're going to start with the material cabinet, which also serves as a printer stand. Once you have unwrapped the plastic from the box, you'll find two Velcro straps that hold the roll-down ramp. Go ahead and peel the Velcro straps and let the ramp unfold. Next, lift the cardboard packaging up to expose the material cabinet and remove the blue plastic covering as well as the wrap. If you're using a box cutter, make sure to cut away from the cabinet so it doesn't damage the painted surfaces. At the bottom of the material cabinet, you'll find a total of four screw-type footings that need to be retracted up to allow the cabinet to freely roll down the ramp. Here, only two of the footings are showing, and you'll find the other two on the opposite side. To retract the footings on the opposite side, you'll need to remove the back panel of the material cabinet to gain better access. The back panel is held by clips, which will disengage once you gently pull on the corners. Now that the cabinet is free to move, grab the cabinet by the frame and carefully roll it down the ramp onto the flat surface. Moving on to the second pallet, which contains the printer itself and the startup kit, you can simply lift the cardboard packaging up to see what's shown here in the video. Have a look at the bill of material attached and make sure everything in the startup kit is present. By setting aside everything from the pallet, except the printer, ensure there is no obstruction in the path from the printer to the material cabinet. Use the straps and the metal poles that came with the packages to rig up lifting handles on either side of the printer, just like how it is shown here. The printer weighs approximately 200 pounds, we recommend having two people on each side to lift the printer by the metal pole handles. Once you have placed the printer on top of the material cabinet, you can now remove the protection pad at the top as well as the lifting straps. As the last step, you can now open the printer chamber door and carefully pull all the protective foam paddings out of the printer. At this point, the printer is fully unboxed and ready for leveling and the rest of the installation process.